see this? That's been there for years. Just rusting away. An eyesore, a death trap. If any of the local ones playing that, cut themselves, they need a tetanus jab. But don't blame the person that's abandoned that there. No, they were lumbered with it, no doubt. Blame the makers of the hit classic British game show, ITV Zone Bullseye. Late 80s, early 90s, old Alec gets the phone call. The old boy enters all the competitions. Is it going to be big break? Is it going to be strike it lucky? Maybe the generation game, but no. It's the granddaddy of them all. Bullseye, super smashing great. He's bullseye bound. He's Dane Dynamite. He's want to sell a video recorder. He's like that, ah, cracking man. I can record the darts and the snooker when I'm doing it at the boozers. When's he sell a dishwasher? He's birds buzzing. Wee dishwasher. When's a Grundig telly? They're loving it. It's time for the main event, the special prize. What's it gonna be? Maybe a wee all expenses paid trip to where the cost is. Brava, Blanca, Del Sol, paid for by fucking Lun Polly or Teletext Holidays. And then they go, and bully special prize. And it's a fucking speedboat. What is Alec for Drumchapel, Castle Milk, Merry Hill, somewhere like that, guy day, with a fucking speedboat? He's not going to take old Doris down to the Clydeside, drop it in, and rally it up and down the river. Dane Donuts. No, it's going to sit there, rusting away for generations, decades. The owner of that boat's probably dead. The motor is long gone. The young team knocked that back in the day, sold it, got a nine bar. He's probably left that in his wall with his wains. They don't even fucking want it. So anytime you see a speedboat sitting in a scheme, a house in a state, what have you, rusting away in a car park, that's why. Bullseye's to blame. I'm telling you. That fucking Jim Bones got a lot to answer for.